Hi everyone and welcome to Spoonful of Paolo! Okay, this is a very special episode because joining me are two bloggers from HealthyDiaries.com. Hi Lisa. Hi. Hi Maria. Hi. Now I don't know if you could see resemblance, but they're twins, identical twins. And on top of that, they're my younger sisters. Yay! <laughs> That's right. Okay, so talk about your blog a little bit so the viewers yeah. would know. Well, Healthy Diaries is basically where Maria and I blog about our healthy lifestyles and we show just the foods we ate and the exercises we do. Mm -hmm. And today, Maria is going to explain what we're doing. What are we doing? Today, we're making donuts. <gasps> donuts! <laughs> yes! <laughs> you might think fried donuts, but these aren't fried donuts. They're much healthier. The latest craze in the blog world has been baked donuts. Mm. They're just as good, but a lot more healthier and a lot better for you. I'm really excited because I'm used to having the fried donuts and they're really, really good. So having baked donuts is going to be pretty interesting. Okay, so what are, what are the steps now? Okay, well the first thing you want to do is preheat your oven to 400 degrees. Okay. Once you do that, you start with the liquid. So Paolo, help me out. <laughs> we have one egg, so you can just beat that a little bit. Such a pretty egg. <laughs> what is that? And then this is just Greek yogurt, um, just plain non-fat Greek yogurt. You could add then it's about six ounces. Six ounces. Just write that down, you home, at home watching this. <laughs> okay. Ooh, this looks good. Yeah, so mix that really well. Okay, I'm doing it pretty good, wouldn't you say? Hi, yeah. Maria. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching you make sure you're doing it right. Thanks. And next, this is four tablespoons of maple syrup. Ooh, syrup. I love syrup. Yeah, good stuff. And lastly, we have a tablespoon of coconut oil that is melted. Coconut? I've never seen coconut oil. Yeah, well... Is it the same? Can they use regular oil? You can use regular oil, but coconut oil just adds more nutrients, and it's really good for your skin and complexion, so... Okay. Now, what's this over here? What are we doing These here? These are the dry ingredients. You want to do this in a separate bowl. Okay. Use that bowl. This is a cup of uh, whole wheat flour. It's um, a lot better than regular flour because it has a lot more nutrients like fiber and protein. Ah. So it's much better for you. Okay. This is three-fourths of a teaspoon of baking powder. Baking powder. And this is three-fourths of a teaspoon of baking soda. Baking soda. We got the sisters and in here. Also, just a little pinch of salt. And I like to use kosher salt. Doesn't matter. Oh, isn't this really simple, Paolo? This is so easy. I can do this without you two. <laughs> oh, I got this at home. Pay attention. Okay, now I'm assuming we're going to put... Yeah, the wet inside, um, mix it into the dry. Can I do that? Yes, you can. Okay, well, you should help me. You should be stirring as I put oh, it in ahead. there. Okay. Okay, just like that. Yeah, mm -hmm. and you want to just um, mix it until it just most of the lumps are gone and everything's mixed in well. So we don't need any chocolate syrup in or anything? Just, no. Just that maple syrup? Just maple syrup. Okay, we'll see how that is. <laughs> And then you keep stirring until it yeah, becomes... Yeah, just until most of the lumps are out and everything's well combined. Can you give me the spatula, Lisa? Yeah. Pretty tastes good. <laughs> okay. And once you're done mixing with that, you want to take a Ziploc bag and just put um, the batter inside the bag. Ooh, can oh, I do... It'll look like that and then you just... Mute. Should I use my hand? No, no, the spatula. <laughs> Why do you clean here, Paolo? I just love my sisters. Why do you guys love me so much? <laughs> oh, Paolo, you're just a great brother overall. And and because you always, you're the first to bake all our recipes. It's so, so true. I always go on HealthyDiaries.com. And I always write my review and what things I like and what I don't like. <laughs> you gotta be so honest. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Get it all in there. Okay. okay. It's good? Yeah. Yes? Okay. Here, Maria, you can do, do this since my hands are all full of batter. Okay. Thanks, Paolo. You're welcome. So you just close it in there and get most of the air out. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to lick it? We'll wait for the finished product. I'd rather not get salmonella poison. <laughs> okay, and then you just want to cut a tip off of um, the bag. Because mm. then we're going to pipe it. You're going to what? Pipe it? Yeah, yeah I'll show you. We're going to pipe it into the, uh, this donut pan that we just sprayed with um, Pam Spray. And if you don't have a donut pan, you could just pipe circles onto a baking sheet and that will work just as well. So it's pretty simple. You want to fill it up um, almost all the way. Because then it's gonna, once you put it in the oven, it's going to rise yeah, then? Yeah, rise and get nice and fluffy. And... You 
at home, if you're, it's not balanced, you just go on one of them and you fill up with the other one. This is like algebra. <laughs> okay, and now we're gonna put this in the oven for 10 minutes yep, yep. and see how that is, okay? Okay, wow, so now you bake them, we bake them for 10 minutes. Yep. But now we're turning them over. Yeah, the other side looks prettier, so we'll just turn them over like they that. They look really, really good. Uh, you smell them? Yeah, I could smell them. I could smell the maple. And how much maple syrup was in there only? We put four tablespoons. Wow. And you cut, you made half of a dozen, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, so now while these cool for a few minutes, do you have that larger bowl, Maria? The bowl behind you. Um, you want to make, we're going to make a coating of cinnamon sugar, just because, you know, in the batter, we didn't put any sugar. It was just maple syrup. So this is um, a fourth of a cup of sugar. Okay. We, we like to use cane sugar too. It's a little less processed. Okay. Um, half or two teaspoons of cinnamon. Mm -hmm. Just mix it up a little bit. So this is how you make cinnamon sugar, Paolo. Wow. I just can't believe because usually you think of donuts, they're being fried, but you guys actually bake them. And I never, yeah. I really never thought you can actually make donuts being baked. That's freaking awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, they're more like a big cake donut, a little uh -huh. more cake texture, but it's uh -huh. just as good. Okay, so you want to put that in like in a uh, shallow dish, and okay. then this is um, two tablespoons of butter, mm. and you just want to brush each donut. Ooh, I'll do that. Just brush them. Yeah, yeah. Well, one by one. Where you help them out? Okay. <laughs> do it all sides. No, wait, just do one by one, pal. Oh, okay. All of it, even the other side. Yeah, all over. It's just so that the sugar will stick to it. We're giving the donut a nice massage. Right. <laughs> Let me help you here. Oh. <laughs> You gotta get all the spot. Okay, and then here, and now Lisa's gonna dip them in the cinnamon sugar. Yep. Do you have a platter, Maria? Yep, here. Buddy, you finish that. Okay. okay. Oh, I could smell the cinnamon sugar. Yeah, how good does it look? Oh my god, you're dip that. <laughs> that looks good. Don't eat it yet. Can I try? Just tell them? Okay, no. we'll wait a little bit. Okay, yeah. be patient. Paolo! We're almost there, almost there. Okay. I love sugar. <laughs> For all my friends who know me, they know I love sugar, okay? All right, now, be honest, try one and tell us if you really think it's good or not. Okay, I'm not gonna, because sometimes you watch shows and like, oh my God, it's so good. No, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, this is gonna be very real, okay? Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> no. So? No, no, I gotta swallow it. It's so, it's so good, huh? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. So, it's really, really good. Like it's good. Mm. You swear? You're not just saying it. I no, not just because they're my sisters, not because I know them, but these donuts are good, and the sugar on top of it is so freaking yeah. good. You guys, honestly, good donuts. Well, what I want to do next is just show you. Um, these are just some store-bought donuts that we bought, and they're cinnamon sugar. Also, we wanted to compare, show you the actual difference between the two. These are about half the calories, much more nutrients. They're baked, they're not fried. So. Oh, these are fried ones? Yeah, these yeah. are fried, Typ your typical sugar. And this has half, ours have half the calories. Mmm, okay. I'm trying to, okay, let me just tell you something. Yeah, fried ones, no good. No, I'm gonna change the way I eat dessert now. Mm. Yeah, so like you can still have foods that taste good, but they're healthy, right? Mm-hmm. That's yeah. the goal. I don't, not crazy about these either. <laughs> not at all. And Paula, no. you know you're sweet, so. Mm. I really want to thank you both because I know you both are very busy blogging every day. So thank you for letting me be here. The donuts are amazing. For more on the recipe, go to spoonfulofpalo.com or go to healthydiaries.com. You get the full recipe over there. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time. Thank you. Yay! Oh, thank you. Yay! Yay, we did it! We did it! Mmm, <laughs> bye-bye.